just to get any idea that you have in your head out there. It's just really like, you feel strong. You, you feel empowered by the words that you're saying. And I feel like if I can make somebody feel something with my work, then I did something good. Like if you, if you use your words like the right way, you can say things to people that'll provoke them to think of things in a different perspective. How we use words, how much diction, tone, syntax we use, it can create a meaningful message. Uh, I have a voice. It doesn't matter how old I am, it doesn't matter what I look, it doesn't matter where I'm from, I have a voice and people can pay attention to it. But I feel like I can change the world in making people like myself, teenagers and such, more informed on what's actually going on, you know, like, um, not be blinded by what people say. And people can express more through writing than they can normally because with writing not only is there creativity but there's also revision with that creativity um, and although revision doesn't sound creative the more you look into the writing I feel like the more you can work on reaching out to people and especially if they can really connect with your message then that's really important And that's, that's what the poem's meant to be for, like, to show people, even in, like, 16 words, oh, that everybody's born different, so you don't have to be perfect, like, because there is no perfect. It was kind of just to get all my feelings down on paper, get them out of my head, and that makes me feel better, or other people use it to, as an inspiration. I've always liked to help people. That makes me feel like I'm actually doing something good and positive. The thoughts of the moon is just like, we think of the moon as an inanimate object, but maybe it has feelings. It's like, it was a poem about this girl who, um, she, she told poetry. It was just about how um, captivating she was. And I, I really wanted to like express that like, People don't just love her because she's a girl reciting poetry. People love her because she's um, captivating, she's interesting, you know, she she has inner beauty as well as outer beauty and stuff like that. So it gives me a self-reflection of who I am. This is me, this is what I'm writing. It just like releases my feeling. I feel that I'm free in order to express myself. I'm not really good with face-to-face -face, uh, conversations, and I feel that when I write, I say what's in my heart and what's on my mind. I feel like everybody's voice should matter. And through writing, I'm, I feel empowered by uh, having that voice, an, anom an, an anonymous voice. It really motivates me. Like Someone's day can easily be changed by the words you um, tell them, say to them. You know, I was able to get out of all of that and I hope my story can inspire somebody else to, you know, want the change, to make those first steps. Uh, I always try to make sure that I always try to stay positive. It, it, because it, usually it's all about perspective. If you want to look at something in a negative way, it's going to be negative. But, but if you look at that same situation and you take it positively, if you actually look at it how what it could be, what you can make it, then it's just going to change everything. Because I feel that people need to see not just themselves but other people as well and other people can express their emotions through their words. But I could also be writing like a message uh, to get a message across to like maybe a certain person or certain people or sometimes it's just for fun you know I just like to uh, write and have a good time with it. I feel like people are mostly their self even if they aren't writing about their self people really connect when they write and you know if we're in a world where individuality is dying writing is definitely one of the best ways to keep individuality alive and if the, the student at the Parkland school she gave a speech on how losing these lives of kids and adults and it's really hurting like it's really sad like there are people like that that use their words and 
there were words that can make you cry, they can make you smile, and it's just really emotional. I've seen people use their words in powerful ways by the way they make change in the world. And a uh, speaker um, that has influenced by is Martin Luther King. Um, he used his own belief and powerful words in order to create change in the, in the world. And I feel that I can use my own mind in order to inspire others to write uh, to their hearts and Or, like, people could look back on that video and be like, oh, well, this makes me happy. Like, one of my favorite YouTubers, Shane Dawson, he spreads positive messages all the time. He, he, he's just like such a cool person. He, he spreads so much positive messages out to people being like, it's okay to be different and stuff. And that's where I got all my sort of inspiration from.